Hello you guys, it's Elsie. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Victoria's Secret but Mist haul. So I have the new perfume. Um, what's it called? Bombshell Isle. I literally forget every single freaking name. But it's called Bombshell Isle and I was really excited to try her because it's beachy and I love my beachy anything. So let's just start with the video already. But first, subscribe to my channel, like this video, comment down below, follow me on Instagram. And let's start with the video already. Just on the title, I think I put like there's like random buttons that I was missing to review. Let's start definitely with the perfume. So this is Bombshell Isle, and this is how it looks. So I already opened it, obviously, and I already try her on and everything. So this is how the perfume looks like, which is freaking gorgeous. I'm obsessed with this little thing and then like the blue, just everything. I'm obsessed with the freaking bottle. It is gorgeous. It has ocean air, pearl peony, and island coconut. Let me try her again. So this one's instantly, it's very aquatic. This one right off the bat reminds me of Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue Forever. Definitely has that like white florals, aquatic um, essence to it. And yeah, to me, this one in light blue forever, like the, that one in specific, not the original, but light blue forever. These two to me are still very feminine. And I say that just because it's aquatic, so sometimes it can be portrayed as having like a little cologne touch to it. That one, I do think the original light blue has it. But light blue forever, I think it's a lot more feminine just because of the white florals that it has. Same thing with this one. It's kind of like oceany, kind of like... um not musky so much but more airy and aquatic so it definitely just reminds you of the ocean being by the beach and just like relaxing like it has like a very relaxed element to it like literally like the ocean you know how you're just laying there and you're just like super relaxed like if like this literally makes you think of that definitely get the coconut on the background which it's not really really prominent and it's just there to make it like give it like a little sweetness to it than just being like too cologne or too oceany which it still is but it definitely has its sweetness to it so i got the perfume with my reward so it was definitely 20 of 50 so i think i ended up paying like 40 bucks for it which i think it's a good deal for a perfume and i didn't got the body spray because i've noticed i don't use the not the body spray but the i think it's called fragrance mist to the perfume because i always want to match them and i always find myself not even using them as often as i do with the perfume so this time i just got the perfume which i think i'm gonna do that from now on definitely unless i don't like it enough to have it on the perfume next we're gonna continue with the pink side so i have the honey strawberry body lotion first of all i always try to get all of the body lotion in this particular formula from the pink side because they're always 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 a plus like i'm obsessed with them it's it has like amazing formula like they're always a plus for sure and i saw strawberry and i immediately panicked like i'm obsessed with anything strawberry and this one's not the exception like smells so good like to me it reminds me of like an actual strawberry cream i think it's because of the honey that it has so mix in together it just makes me think of strawberries and cream oh my god it's so pretty so yummy like it makes me think of a dessert like literally strawberries and cream it's so so good it smells edible to me like so so edible almost on the gourmand side but very 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 girly like i'm obsessed with this one and i really really wish they had a body spray but instead of having the body spray to this they have this new one which is called honey passion fruit which is this one i'm obsessed with the packaging it is so pretty this one has juicy passion fruit honey nectar and coconut palms and this one to me it smells so so good it has this and longevity as well i don't try to grab a lot of their body sprays because normally they're not my favorite 
body spray form i guess because i hate the freaking spray Some of them are definitely the exception and this one's so so good to me it literally smells like a passion fruit starburst like smells so much like candy either it reminds me of a passion fruit starburst or it reminds me of a passion fruit drink like it's like it's that sweet that juicy and it smells a lot like passion fruit like so so sweet like candy and so so yummy like i'm obsessed with this one i feel like it's such a good one for the spring and summer definitely very refreshing coconut it has a hint to it as well like not too much like straight up coconut like i feel like it has like a slight less hint and i feel like that's why it's making me think of a passion fruit starburst literally like the candy because i feel like it's giving like a lot of like creaminess a lot of like it's sweetness so it just makes me think of candy so yummy it's so girly definitely such an a plus for spring and summer these two so so good so i got like two more from the pink side so i got the new pink beach as well which is this one and this one has sun-kissed coconut and juicy papaya i'm not gonna lie it reminds me a lot of beach nectar from last year yeah i think it was last year it reminds me so so much of that one so if you have that one i don't think you need this necessarily like beach nectar they both smell like fruits like papaya but i feel like beach nectar smells more it has more of this like guava very juicy fruity feeling to it and this one has a lot more of coconut mixed in with papaya so the other one has more of this like fruity juicy tropical drink at the beach type of scent and this one has a lot more of this like creaminess more coconutty sweetness to it than the other one so it did de it depends more on your style but i do like both so i might end up keeping this one even though it reminds me a lot of the other one so the other one that i got was the coconut sun which is the one in the yellow packaging so this one has toasted coconut and sunny vanilla so i'm not crazy about this one to be honest with you it smells a lot like coconut like a lot but it says it has vanilla but to me i feel like it's more of this like freshy coconut it makes me think a little bit of bronze coconut which i feel like i like a lot better than this one so i am not going to keep this one i don't think but i try to keep it like minimal with the pink side because they're not my favorite so i think this is going to go back i'll have a lot more coconut scents that i like better than this one it's sweet but to me it's more on the freshy side and i don't know if that's my nose or what it is but it's honestly the truth like that's what i get from here and i don't think i'm gonna keep her for sure all right so next this is actually new so i took advantage of the i think it was five each it was five for 25 everything so i took advantage and i grabbed the this one from their what is, what is it called like the balance collection i wasn't going to grab it because of that same reason because of the pricing they're really more pricey than the other ones but since they were all for five four twenty five i was like okay let me try this this is the aloe aloe this is the aloe water and hibiscus and just refresh so this one's new on that balance collection so at first when i first sprayed her i got confused because i was like this smells so good and then I try her on my skin and I kept smelling this sanitizer type of scent to it. And I literally asked my husband, and he was literally like, yeah, you smell like hand sanitizer. So I feel like it smells like that. I feel like it smells like soap or some sort of smell like that. Hand sanitizer, soap, cleaning product, something like that. I feel like I liked it at first because when I first put her on the cap, it made me want to smell like that but i think now that i was wearing it on my actual skin i feel like i like this type of scent on candles like my whole house. like that like very clean very soapy but i don't usually like them on me so i think that's actually like the difference that i had to learn throughout the year because i wanted to keep her because like certain scents like this because i like how they smell but also i learned to distinguish between wanting to smell it on my actual skin or wanting to smell like my house on a candle or some sort of other form like that you know so i will love this one on a candle or soap 
but not on me. So I'm definitely going to return this one or a changer. I kind of want to get another almond oat milk. I think that's what it's called. Body spray and exchange it for that one because that one I freaking love and I'm almost out of that one. So the other one that I was missing to review, this is the Blackberry Bite, which is the one in the beautiful purple packaging. So this one has a wet blackberry and chilled amber and water lotus soak. So this one smells amazing. It really smells like blackberry candy to me and I love that the amber it's not like very prominent it's not like too floral like to me it just smells like a blackberry candy it has a beautiful like watery blackberry feeling to it which reminds me of like if you're eating like a blackberry candy and you just smell like the liquid inside like if it reminds me of that it's that sweet like candy and it's so so good super like watery and refreshing and beautiful but it is extremely extremely freaking light on me like it disappears less than five minutes less than three minutes i don't know instantly right away I don't know, but it just disappears so so quick. It really sucks in longevity. So they last like a couple, at least a couple of minutes. I'm fine with it, but this one literally like disappears within probably seconds, like instantly. And I hate that. I wish it was like stronger, tiny little bit stronger, just a tiny bit, at least decent, you know what I mean, at least decent, like maybe an hour or 30 minutes at least, but this literally disappears in seconds, definitely going to return her just because of that reason, and if anything I have, I think Bath, Bath and Body Works, Blackberry and Basil, that one it's a lot better, in my opinion so it's kind of similar a little bit tiny little similar but yeah it smells amazing but it's not staying in my large collection like I really don't need it so last one I have that I was missing this is Petal Plush Clouds and it's the one in the beautiful blue packaging so this one has peony sugar bergamot tea leaves and mimosa flower I feel like this happened the same thing with the other one with it did with a low water and hibiscus i loved it instantly when i first spray her at the store but then once i was wearing her i did not like her on me like to me it smells like straight up herbs very green-ish like that and i don't love those scents normally on me but i love them on candles maybe more floral or something i don't know what i was expecting from here but i think the tea note maybe maybe that that takes over and to me just smells like a sugary earth tea i don't really like the scent on me like i feel like i'm not gonna reach for it that often it smells good but i feel like it's not my type of body spray so like it smells so good like once i'm smelling this but definitely not on me tea note it's like the star of the show definitely and to me just like i said it smells like herb tea so definitely not me so i am going to return this one all right you guys so that was pretty much it for this mini review haul i guess of the ones that i was missing i'm going to return a couple but i'm keeping the rest i think pretty soon i'm going to do a body spray decluttered video i've been decluttering literally my entire life literally my entire closet the body spray definitely going to record and show it to you in a future video there's literally clothes everywhere in this video room so you're definitely going to see that upcoming video that's pretty much it thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe to like this video to comment down below let me know your thoughts specifically on that perfume on that uh bombshell aisle perfume let me know your thoughts down below also follow me on instagram and i hope to see you in my next video bye